Hi, hello everyone. This is Soumya from Bookfeast channel. Today we are going to see the review of the novel titled The Merry Adventures of Robin Hood, which was written by an American author and an illustrator, Howard Pyle. So this novel it is in the form of episodic and uh, when it started it was really in the uh, ballad form. Robin Hood ballads was his title and this made the author to write the ballad of the 14th century to a novel in the 19th century. The main reason behind his writing it as a novel is that uh, he wanted to influence a hero and popularize the character in the modern era. So these uh, his uh, particularly this novel has been influenced in many books films and artworks since its publication it was published in the year 1833 now let's get into the summary of the novel so the place in which the novel begins is nottingham england and during that period england was particularly ruled by the king henrik 2 and uh, robin hood is a character and uh, the group of men who assembled him are uh, named as merry men so merry is the word which is known for happiness here the group of people under robin hood as their captain they live in the deep sherwood forest and the people uh, around his area i mean around the sherwood forest are very fond of him because he never wanted to follow the legal rules he followed the illegal rules and made deeds what is special deed is uh, stealing from the rich and giving it to the poor it could fetch many lives as well as the rich and the poor and no one's life is left alone so this was greatly influenced and greatly uh, appreciated by the uh, common people of his era robin hood has been uh, has been an outlaw since his 18th birthday uh, during that he has uh, participated in archery contest and he won in that and the people who were the losers in the competition they were all drunkards and they aimed uh, for robin hood to kill him but however he managed to escape from them and he killed especially a main person who was the relative to the king of that era so from that time onwards uh, the nottingham sheriff who has uh, never perceived robin wanted to attack him and wanted even to wanted to kill him because the main person he killed was his cousin who were who was also a participant in the archery contest so this made him take revenge over robin hood so within a year of becoming an outlaw robin hood was elected as a leader and uh, he is a leader for the people who live in the sherwood forest they band together to fight injustice using their sharp wits and also the various trade skills so here the plot of the novel starts where the sheriff of uh, nottingham plans and plots to make attempts there were uh, three attempts which were made to catch robin hood and to punish him for his crime the first attempt would be uh, he sends a tinker to serve for robin and uh, also to warrant and arrest him when robin hood he comes to know about the plan he traps the tinker by mixing a strong drink which is filled with sedative and later he was killed so in that time he has uh, taken opportunity of stealing his documents the tinker's documents and the second attempt would be uh, to capture robin hood staged as an archery event in nottingham when the sheriff has uh, an idea of getting a uh, overall view of the robin hood he come across that he is in uh, his best in archery so he wanted to plot him and he wanted to kill him and also he announced that people who stage an archery event in nottingham will be awarded with the cash prize this made uh, robin hood take part in it however he dressed himself in a disguised manner and he uh, won the championship he never stopped from that he also wrote a note for the sheriff Uh, stating that uh, he could never capture robin hood or he could never capture any of his people so this made sheriff more angry and go attempt for the third one however he won in the contest uh, and he had a cash prize he was now his victory was not short lived uh, the sheriff captures one of the merry men that is one of the people who works under robin hood in the sherwood forest and he proclaims to kill him if robin hood never uh, comes to the nottingham this news of uh, putting him and uh, went into the ears of robin hood and he was in the idea of uh, bringing him out of his death so this made him come uh, to the city and he explored his himself when the little john comes to see this he gave an opportunity for both robin hood and his men to free from it and escape into the forest again and uh, he solved all the problems almost it seems to be so called problems and it seems to be solved 
and uh, this made arrangement between the sheriff and the robin hood to meet together and solve the problem when he goes to the town in a disguised form he sa- started uh, selling meat he went on a meat cart and he started selling meat his shop was set up next to the guard hall this uh, made a trick he made the sheriff to buy a deer instead of a cow for his feast and then he escapes from that again this made more and more angry for sheriff on the robin hood so the frustrated sheriff he had uh, no other idea to do so he again uh, plan an action to kill him once more and here the main uh, role enters which is a professional thief he was named as guy of guys bowne and uh, he was uh, sent to murder robin hood when both come for a duel both fight against each other and robin uh, wins in the match but however he wins he was severely wounded he had uh, no other way to go so finally he decided to reach his uh, cousin's home and when he went there his cousin she is the one of the uh, prioress of the nursery and she is in uh, kirikles so this made her think over again and again if she accepts robin hood and if she gives him a place to stay it would definitely be a best example for the other person to become an outlaw so she had no other option and uh, from her heart even though she wants to save him instead uh, she let him beat to death so this made uh, robin hood die and the merry adventure of robin hood ends up with a tragedy where the note starts with the title merry towards the end it ends as a tragedy though it's in tragedy it clearly celebrates the heroic figure of robin hood and the main initiative uh, to come up with the ability of individual to question authority and also to practice the moral laws and actions independently of the law so here i conclude my novel if you are in uh, need of any novels short stories or any other works and interpretations please do mention in the comment section we'll surely make it for you please do like share comment and subscribe thank you